Legends. Come on, man. I know you. I know you're busy. I see you running around. We get 30 seconds of time. We get 30 seconds. This is a busy man, but the legendary Coach Larry Merritt, uh, Roxbury Boys and Girls Club, MABC, the base, Cathedral. Um, truly, man, someone that I watch. I remember watching one of his teams at Cathedral, and he had like five guards out there. And all they did was press the whole game, and it was like truly inspiring at the time because I was like, wow, in the city you could have like teams like this play this style and like and, and be successful. So um, thank you, first of all, for sitting down, Absolutely. taking Thanks some of your time, and joining. Um, but the base, the yes, base is a free program for no, AAU, a no cost program. A no cost program. So, so talk to us about the base and all that type of stuff that you're doing now. So base, you know, we we you know our goal is to provide you know opportunities, access and opportunities yep. for urban talent um, through basketball, baseball, softball college and career development, health and wellness. And we are a no-cost program located right in the heart of Roxbury yep. at 150 Shirley Street. Nice, nice. Um, I don't want you to show your age too much, but how long have you been in the coaching game? I know I ran down some of the, the stops that you had that I've just saw as well, well, I go, far. Well, I'm not going to put no age to it. But <laughs> don't started, put an age to it. Just I started say volunteering long. working with kids in the after school program in 1987. Wow. So, so I'm gonna leave it there. I'm okay. Leave it there. All right. All right. Who? Um. I saw you talking to the legendary uh, Charlie Titus as he yes. walked in the door. Yes. Um. Who have been or who are some of your biggest coaching influences, right? That have shaped you and to make you wanna to be a coach the way you have and coach the style. You no. Know, when you go back to when I started playing, you look at you know Carnell Pokey Suttles. You look at Lewis Bryant. Um, you look at those guys back there that was really. Just taking, you know, kids just who you were know, just regular general members of the Boys and Girls Club at the Salvation Army and really just working on what they got. So they really inspired me to want to get back to my community. So when I graduated, I knew right off the top that I wanted to come back and work with the urban talent. What What are some of the biggest uh, characteristics or attributes, I would say, when you're looking at a particular kid, whether it be for the base program, um, for your, I'm not sure if you even coach high school ball anymore. No, but, I do not. Okay, but what are, what are some of the biggest characteristics you're looking for in a player? So before we look at the player, we're looking at the parent. You know, you second person. You're the second. You're the second yeah, person that got out here and said. We definitely, that. we're not just you know recruiting and not using the word attracting the student athlete, but we definitely want to look at the parent. You know, because that says a lot about the family structure. So from there, then we look at the student athlete. We're definitely gonna look at the books. We want to know how they're doing academically. Because if they're not, they're not solid students, then we want to work on them to become solid students. If they still choose not to be solid students, then they're not remarkable to the college and universities, which is, you know, the post-secondary opportunities available. I think people also got to look at, too, that, you know, college isn't always the answer. There's yeah, a lot nope. of trades out there. Yep. You know, my daughter graduated from, from high school, and she's in college, but she's a licensed cosmetologist, mm -hmm. and wow. she has her own business. So Amazing. we got we got to also start looking at the inner talents of a lot of our, our young people and really, really, really build off the gifts that they have. Because it's not always sports. Sports is a vehicle that opens up doors and opportunities, but then now we've got to see what the real talent is. Have you, and, I, and I, it's funny you say what the comment you just said, because I asked I, Kenneth Booby Jackson over here earlier, so I asked him, have you ever had to turn down a really talented player because of the aspect of the parenting, where you were just like, I love this kid, but his parent just maybe a little bit too much for me, so I'm gonna turn this kid down and turn him away. And we dealt with every, I mean, in my years of coaching and working in youth development, we dealt with every every possible scenario. Yep. Uh, we just, we hope that that's the last resort. Right, that we right, gotta yep. remove a kid from a program because, of, because of the behavior of their parents. So yep. we hope that parents will make the adjustment. But we also have situations where parents remove themselves because they knew that the kids would benefit so much from the program. Mm. Okay. And they sit back and allow you to and they coach. They sit back and allow us to, to do what we do. Okay, okay. Well, man, I don't want to take up too much of your time. Nah, man, man. I, Listen, I appreciate it. I no, appreciate I, appreci it. I appreciate you, Coach, for Absolutely. sitting down, chopping it up. Like anytime, I said, anytime. Been, a, been a fan of yours for a while, man. Well, thank Just you, man. Watching the game from afar, Absolutely. how you play it, how you approach it, how you coach it. Definitely been a fan. And I was actually. Uh, working at Crystal Ray when you were the coach also. Oh, wow. I was a chef oh, wow. there. Was oh, a were you? Yeah, I was a chef oh, there. Oh, good, man. Good. So yeah, that was, my stop. that was my stop after Cathedral. Then we built a little dynasty over there, and yep. then it was uh, time to move on from there as well. Absolutely. You know? Absolutely. All right. Well, coach, told... always a pleasure, man. Absolutely, man. Thank you, man. Be well. Oh, God bless you. Yes, sir. Yes, Take sir. Care. Yes, sir. Take care. The legendary Larry Merritt. You know what I mean?
super duper legend over here. So I've, man, listen, I've, 